Boxing Ego here. If you like this video, make sure you hit the like button and also subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon on the top of your screen to get notified when the latest new content drops. One. Anthony Joshua and Gerald Big Baby Miller take to their social medias to react to their run-in at the DAZN press conference. Stay tuned. What up, Fight World? It's your boy Ego, and I'm back with some more boxing. Make sure you smash the like button. Also, subscribe to the channel for the latest and greatest in boxing. If you want to become part of the gang gang, notification gang, please hit the bell icon. Shout out to the Super Chats channel donations, the Venmo donations, and the Patreon family. We working. Shout out to everybody, all the support egos army the subscribers there's a link in the description this year september canelo versus golovkin fight week the box fan expo link in the description it's an affiliate link i do want to warn you guys it helps the channel if you purchase your tickets through the affiliate link but the box fan expo is going to be lit this year they've had a lot of great past guests i will get you guys the the current roster as the names um confirm but they already have some great names i can't reveal some of them because i think they're kind of in the process but past people that went to box friend expos you had everyone from mike tyson to i think danny garcia floyd mayweather was there last year when i was at it so it's lit make sure you guys check out it and if you want to support the channel use the affiliate link in the description to buy your tickets and if you're already going to be out in in vegas you should go because it's before there's nothing happening on Saturday up until the fight, right? And then there's things that happen after the fight and at a certain time, the fight and the fight card. But this is all before the, the undercards and stuff start. So come out for a good time. Anthony Joshua, social media, he posted the run-in. This is him and Povetkin. And you've seen Gerald Miller, Big Baby Miller, who is announced. He's a signed fighter for the DAZN platform, a new streaming app with Eddie Hearn and his... Um, counterparts I guess you could say this let's take a look at it Joshua looked pissed. And Gerald Miller, he was he wasn't backing down either. Anthony Joshua in the caption said, "Massive respect to Povetkin. When two lions meet and you hear a little pup barking, don't play with the big cats. That's a warning." And he put a lion hashtag AJ Boxing. So that's his reaction to what took place. Gerald Miller has also responded. We'll get to that. And Povetkin kind of just played it cool. He wasn't. He's was like, "This ain't had nothing to do with me." Um, Joshua, he, he didn't like the heckling, the taunting, thought it was disrespectful, so he had to walk over there or whatever. And then this is Gerald Big Baby Miller, he's verified too, and this is what he put. He posted a picture, and he says, I know this boy got too much sugar in his tank. I'm going to turn you into Kool-Aid. You sweet and low. He said, you sweet and low, you English muffin. I smell pussy. Dominic Brazil, Charles Martin, and Deontay Wilder ain't about that life but i am boy take that thong off that eddie hearn damn the spelling is kind of bad eddie hearn bout i'm going to fuck you till you love me fag wow he, he recited the mike tyson line hashtag brooklyn queens bitch wow so that's his response the spelling was a little bit don't blame me but the way he spelled some of the stuff was a little bit hard to read like, he didn't even spell the Eddie right. E-D-D-I. He might have been driving or something when he did it. But that's his reaction to it. He also did a little photo op with Povetkin. So that's the reaction from both fighters. This is cool and all, but 
the man next to Gerald Miller is the one that's getting the opportunity, the mandatory. That's Alexander Povek, and he's the one that's getting to fight Joshua. So although this is good hype for a potential future fight, one, everybody wants to see the Deontay Wilder versus Joshua fight before anything. Even they wanted to see it before the Povekin fight. So that's my thoughts. And you know what's interesting to me? Like I said, it looked like Joshua didn't even want to be there from jump. Like his face, like look right here. This is before, I don't know, maybe Miller had been saying stuff, but he just looked pissed and looked mad or whatever. And I think it's because the feedback that he's getting, the poor feedback from the, the Wilder fallout, right? And he just looked irritated. But I do like seeing this side of Joshua, like just show, you know what I mean? Like I'm a man, you got to respect me. You, you barking up this, you saying and he's responding to this. The only thing is where was this same energy when Wilder has been doing the same thing and he had the opportunity to do it in the physical so don't please don't blame that on Wilder but Joshua said he can't come in the ring you know what I'm saying so he was going to come to the Parker fight and should you win he said he had every intention to get in the ring team Joshua and Eddie Hearn and Anthony Joshua put that order of protection out and said no you ain't getting in the ring you know what I mean but you had Gerald Miller who just did the same thing. I mean, that's what it, it would have been the same thing for Wilder. But see, this is the other thing is just keep the same energy. Why was Wilder not allowed to the ring? See, I think I think he respects Wilder, right? I'm not saying he doesn't respect Gerald Miller, but if you look at just knockout percentage, you look at Gerald Miller's versus Wilder, Wilder is clearly the bigger puncher, right? So I think he it's just different I, I just think he respects like he knows like even if it was on some street shit like like where fist flew water he's not going to back down them southern boys ain't playing I'm trying to tell you I don't know everything about the south I'm a west coast dude but I have a lot of partners from the south and I've been to certain places in the south them southern dudes don't really be playing they really you know what I'm saying they really about that life you can get the free smoke and I think Joshua realizes that because it is he shows the different side like the Dominic Brazil Gerald Miller neither one of them are the same type of punchers as Wilder in my opinion and the way he when they started disrespecting him the way he responds to them I want to see why you haven't done that to Wilder who's done the same thing he's like Anthony Joshua run 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 Eddie's breastfeeding you you Annabelle you a cow you getting milk boy like he's saying all like similar stuff like you know so it's just like why is it not why is he not being met with the same energy but then you you make this whole post massive respect to Povekian I guess for being professional when two lines meet you hear a little pup barking that's a warning so all the stuff that Wilder said why are you not having that same energy and warning him the same way that, that's the only thing I don't understand but as far as the Gerald Miller situation I like how both fighters held their own and like responded and none of them look like they're backing down people just want to see that same energy with joshua when it comes to wilder that's my two cents let me know what you guys think and i don't want to see the gerald miller joshua fight if joshua gets past povetkin next he needs to fight wilder and fuck the we need to give him less than 15 million you need to give him more you need to give him a percentage anything you could do to make sure that the fight happens and if they don't then to me they're they're the culprit they're the problem like they have been the problem team joshua because why all of a sudden is it a, a, a sin to collect that last belt and give the man a percentage now you're talking about 15 flat and he deserves less so um this was great buzz for Gerald Miller's career and AJ, you know, and it's cool to see AJ responding. But the next order of business, should he get past Povetkin, which is a dangerous fight, it should be Wilder without any doubt. Everybody else should have to wait. Look at all these belts in his hand. You would have Sophia, a respected WBC belt, the green strap that everybody knows. Uh, it's a good sanctioning company, the Suleiman family, rich history in boxing. You have all these damn belts and you can have the green belt Sophia to add to that collection and that's the belt that is worldly recognized and you know every great champion has had that I can't think of one person who is like revered in the top boxing like top boxing list that never had a any version of the WBC belt in any weight classes that they were at I can't think of anyone so we know what it is that's the reaction from Gerald Big Baby Miller and Anthony Joshua definitely um barking at each other and 
not feeling each other let me know your thoughts drop your thoughts in the comment section make sure you smash the like button as always hey comment and subscribe till next video is ego signing off so if you enjoyed this video and want more content like this on the channel you can show your appreciation by going to the paypal donate button or the youtube support button and you can donate any amount that you feel is equivalent to the value of this video much more to come thank you guys for your support boxing ego the future of boxing